Hi guys, good morning. Ooh, coming at you again today with fresh face, but I did shower today. Oh, I shaved my legs, I shaved my whole body, and I washed my hair. So I had a nice shower. My hair is like literally soaked. I'm just waiting for my mom. We're going to a thrift store, which I'm actually really excited about because I kind of want to see if they have any cute like boots or just kind of poke around. I love going to the thrift store. It's like one of my favorite things to do, um, especially with like family or friends. But yeah, this morning I had the day off. So I just woke up and had a cup of coffee and then I went straight into editing. I got a whole video done today, which is such a good feeling. Um, and then when I was at work, I got like so many thumbnails done for like, I think eight videos, eight or nine, but yeah. So that's pretty much what I'm up to today. I'm starting this off as a new vlog because I just ended my other vlog, um, yesterday in my car. So I'm just picking up today's vlog at home. This is my outfit. Just wearing some really cute leggings. They're so soft. Um, and then like a really nice oversized crop t-shirt. You can tighten it, but I don't want to tighten it. Um, I just kind of like the loose fit, but yeah, I just have some brow gel in moisturizer. I need to throw on some Carmex um, and I'm wearing the Body Shop. What is this perfume? Okay, so this perfume is called British Rose. Oops. by the body shop. I'll edit the focus after if it works. Um, but yeah, so just getting ready to thrift with my mom, but I thought I would start this vlog off with, I guess, updating you with my day. Um, and yeah, I'm gonna finish getting ready and I'll pick you guys up in a little bit. I thought it was cute. All right, you guys, we just finished thrifting. My mom's laughing because I literally never vlog, but yeah, we're heading home now. I got literally two really, really cute rain jackets and I got um, three pairs of boots and a pair of rollerblades and a necklace and forgetting something. Oh, I was gonna get a pair of socks, but I didn't. 
and I think I got something else, but yeah. So we just finished thrifting. So cute. I love these earrings. I like thrifted them as well. But heading home now. <laughs> so pretty on the chain that's obviously it down there and then the chain is like that but I just thought it was so pretty it's the same size as the cross I have so it'll look cute kind of stacked with other necklaces but I just thought it was so pretty and I absolutely love it I do need to clean it though all right so I also got this black trench coat it's just a classic um black trench coat um it is really good for like rainy weather I guess it has like these beautiful gold buttons and it is vintage this is actually from Thunder Bay. So, super cute pockets. It was missing a button on the top, which I was actually so sad about on one of the sides, but I found it in the pocket. I think it was $19.99. Here's the back. And this is just so cute. It's like a pair of like leather boots and a nice black bag. Super, super neutral. And I really, really love this coat. All right, so trench coat number two. Again, this is vintage from Thunder Bay um, in Canada, but I love the feeling of it. It's so soft. I know a lot of like raincoat material jackets or even winter coats can have like a really rough texture and it's just not my kind of jacket. I hate that texture. It just is so scratchy and just not soft to the skin at all. This is the opposite. It's really, really soft and I love it. Um, still very structured though, so the material is very structured, but it's just a softer form of material. But this is more of like a gray taupe-ish trench coat, same style as the other. This one actually has bronze buttons, so gorgeous. The vintage coats are just absolutely stunning. I have a couple vintage fur coats, but the vintage, you know, trench coats are just so cute for fall. But the back, there's a nice button detail. And then the top has, these ones, this one actually has shoulder pads, which I love. I love a nice structured jacket. I just think it looks so professional and put together. Um, and I love this color too. So this would be really cute with like maybe a, a nude-ish boot, but so cute. And all the buttons are on this one, thankfully, but I'm absolutely obsessed with this. Okay, so like another little haul find. I got these for $14.99. They're just a pair of really classic roller blades. I literally am obsessed with these. They don't even make these anymore. They're ultra wheels. Um, and like this one has the brake, obviously. The color is such a gorgeous forest green. Just like a classic, you know, I don't even know, like a classic color, I feel like for that time frame. But I'm obsessed. These fit so perfectly and i tested them on in the store and they literally roll perfectly so for 14.99 i got myself a pair of roller blades and i literally love these so much like i the other i think it was like last year i really wanted to go rollerblading with my brother and i just did not have a nice pair of roller blades and a brand new set is like what 200 dollars from like sport check or like any sports store so finding these in like pristine condition for $14.99 with the gorgeous like classic shiny forest green. This one still has like a kick stop. This is going to be so nice to bike on the trails with my brother in the summer. I'm just like so excited. But there's the classic sticker. I'm just like so happy to pick these up. Totally random, but totally worth it in my opinion. And the wheels just look so good. Oh, I guess I should mention the closures are all like those like click buttons. Like I'll try to show you where you like click it up and then adjust it and then just like, click it to tighten it. So 
I love that. I'm just, I'm so obsessed. I'm so happy and I'm so excited to use these next summer. Next are just these gorgeous tan suede boots. I literally love these. These are from Nine West. A lot of like, call it spring heels, have this detail on the heel as well. But the zipper is gold. It says Nine West. It's just absolutely stunning. This kind of boot in the, in the fall and winter is just an absolute staple. And when I saw these, I just could not resist. So I absolutely love this color. I love the feeling. Um, and I'm just, I'm so happy that I was able to find such a great Nine West boot. Next are these absolutely stunning leather boots. They fit my legs so tight. Usually I'm not a fan of boots that have like a buckle, but I literally love these. They're so classic. Everyone needs like a nice black pair of leather boots. Again, they have the great chunky heel. These are so comfortable to walk in in the winter time. And I just feel like a classic staple, you know, leather boot. I actually kind of do like the buckle detail, which is weird for me because I usually go for like something completely neutral. But I think because these are straight leather, like the entire boot is completely leather. The buckle just kind of gives it an extra little flare and I actually am obsessed with it. Again, leather detail with the zipper. Super classic, just like a simple black boot for fall. But I really, really, really love these. I'm excited to get some use out of these. They're so comfortable. They're nothing like, you know, a thin heel that you can wear for like a dinner and then go home. These you can definitely hit the town on and I'm just like so excited. I love, 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 love black leather boots. I don't know the brand of these. We weren't able to see the brand. They're like deep inside the boot, but they're nothing crazy. Like they're not like brand name. Well, maybe they are, who knows, but I don't really care. They're absolutely gorgeous. The leather, so excited to have these in my collection. Also ignore the rag. I'm like literally in the middle of like wiping all of these down and just cleaning them, but so, so, so gorgeous. So those are the first two. And then I also got, um, these were a shock because I wasn't going to purchase them because they're actually kind of outside my comfort zone. But I literally am obsessed with the detail. If you guys look, there's like this, it's like a mix of crocodile with this like, how do I explain it? It's like a soft kind of textured and it's all patchwork. And when I saw these, I was like, okay, these are so weird and funky and I actually am obsessed with them. And then obviously when I put them on, I, I just, it was funny cause I was with my mom and we were like trying shoes on and she's like, you forgot to put your regular shoes on. So I was literally wearing these because they were just so comfortable and like easy to wear, which basically tells you that if they're that comfortable, you should probably buy them. But again, super chunky heel, extremely comfortable. You can wear these for like a long night out. Oh, there's a play siren, love that. But yes, extremely comfortable. I also love the sheen. Like you guys can see the light off the crocodile print. And then the rest is just like that soft, it's almost like cow fur. I'm obsessed. I, again, a really, really chunky heel. I love chunky heels, if you guys can't tell. Um, the thin heels are really, really pretty. My mom got a pair of thin heel shoes. She's also really, really short. So she even said like she was probably gonna wear them like one time. They're just like cute to have. But for me, I like classic staples in my wardrobe. I love the button detail at the back there. Um, what brand are these actually? The Wishbone Collection. So I'm not really sure what brand that is. If you guys know, just leave it in the comments below. But I love the sheen of the crocodile with this, with the, I guess like, you know, like suede soft material. Gorgeous, pointy toe, you can never go wrong. Such a staple, just fun to wear with like a bag that might not be like fully leather or something. But I really, really love these and they're again, so, so comfortable. So I'm just like obsessed. Oh my God, that beef looks so good. So tonight we're just having taco in a bowl. We got this really, really good pico de gallo from Costco. It literally tastes so fresh. I wish we got a, would have got some fresh lime with it because it would have been so good. Sriracha, can't go wrong in here. Just some fresh chopped red onion. I love fresh red onion. Also freshly chopped red pepper, so good. Some salsa. And we have these chips that I'll show you guys in two seconds. 
Okay, and the chips you guys have probably seen, they're organic, which is super cool, but they're just these jalapeno lime. I think this brand, I'm not sure if you can only get it at Costco, but it literally is so good. These chips, the seasoning is perfect. It's not too much, but I absolutely love it. And so yeah, we're just gonna make some bowls, um, throw a couple sauces in with the ground beef and just have like a cute little taco night. You guys need to try these chips if you're into like spicy chips. I literally thought these were gonna be so much more spicy than they were, but they're actually not that bad. They're just like the sweet ghost pepper potato chips um, cooked in 100% avocado oil. But, and they're obviously from Canada. These ones um, we got at Costco. So I don't know if you guys have these where you're from, but they're literally delicious. I thought they were gonna be so much hotter than they were, but I guess obviously because they're from Costco and you know, a lot of white people go to Costco. It's like not that spicy, but for me, like I love spicy food. Like I can definitely handle the heat and like these just have a really good flavor and taste to me. Like they're not too spicy. Again, it says hot, but oh my God, if you haven't tried these and you like spicy food, literally you need to get on this. They're so fucking good. Um, but yeah, they're not that hot, at least in my opinion. So, but they're so good. Like the taste, like if you're looking for like, I guess, not just heat, but like also the taste, these are like literally delicious. <sighs> Back home for the day. Um, thrifting with my mom was so much fun. I cherish memories like that so much. There's nothing like, I can't even explain it. There's nothing like thrifting with my mom. I don't know, we've done it since I was a kid and it's just, it's so nice to like see old stuff and just hear my mom laugh. She saw a Christmas gift that she purchased. It was like a golf gift and she was laughing so loud and the whole store was just like, could hear her and it's just, I love moments like that and trying on shoes and jackets and it's just so much fun. So I'm home now. I'm gonna clean up the stuff. There was a jacket that is missing a button. So I'm gonna sew the button on the jacket and just wipe down everything and put it away and clean up. But, oh, I'm so thirsty. I need to like chug a bottle of water. But yeah, I just wanted to end this vlog here. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed watching. I had a really nice, peaceful <laughs> day. And yeah, I love you guys so much and I'll see you in the next video.